I wouldn't cheat. I th- I'll try my hardest pause to make this. I'd I'll try harder than I've ever tried in ever any relationship ever to make this. I, I'm so grateful of this. I'll try my hardest <laughs> pause to make this work. I'll be a good man. I'll go church. I'll go. I'll be a Jehovah's Witness for a polygamous relationship. I'm telling, I'll try so hard pause to make this work. <laughs> You see, like if a woman walks past you, yeah. I have to look back at her mouth. <laughs> I didn't even have to say it. Because you know what I thought one day, yeah? You know, like them clickers things that like bouncers have, yeah? <laughs> like if I clicked every time I looked at a girl's back, do you know what my number would be? What's the man doing? Where the man doing? You get used to it, man. Trust me, you get used to it. That was it. it. That's my intro. That was it. it Alright, let's get into it straight away, man. And I'm not pausing. Man. I'm not doing no pauses this episode. <laughs> None. Is that on camera? Yeah. I don't care how far it is. <laughs> right, we're going to get into the emails first, yeah? Title. Do you man think I'm gay or not? Hi, guys. I need some advice. A few years ago, I was watching a football match on my phone, but my phone died. So I was looking for a place to watch the match. Only place I could find was a gay bar. When I first entered, I said no homo three times. I appreciate that. <laughs> I appreciate that. I am back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm, back. I'm pausing. Now? I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> Freddy Krueger. <laughs> Candy man, three times in a row. No homo three no times. Homo. But when I told the man that they all said I could be gay, even though I said no homo what's being in there, I've been questioning my sexuality. But I'm certain I'm not gay. I was wondering if kids can relate. Why me? Why have I got a rate? Now, do you know what's mad? Oh, I'll let you boy. Let me tell you what I can relate. Let me tell you what I can relate, yeah? Because when I used to work at a certain, in a certain field, yeah, I was around a lot of gay people. And... What field is this, you sex one, worker? One, 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 of, one, of my, one of my customers, yeah, was gay. But he was my best customer. Like, he used to spend the most money, bro. He wanted that pink pound. Bro, so, bare times, he's like, yeah, come out of us, come out. I'm like, nah, man. <laughs> That's disrespectful. I'm like, nah, yeah. man. I'm not, nah, bro. I'm not, I'm not on that. He's thinking that like, I'm spending at least two, three hundred pounds a week with you. You can't just forward out with me and my brethren. So I said, nah, I'm not doing that. One time he's phoned me, maybe like 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock, but he's in the club. He's like, yeah, I'm in the club. Come and meet me, innit? I'm like, nah, man. Like, hey, I don't want to go into no... That's what man do for the links, you know? <laughs> 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 but he's like, yeah, I've got, I've got he's a of coffee. So me, like a flipping <laughs> whore for the money, I've got in the club now. Bro, when I... You better pump it when, up. Hey, when I put it in there, yeah? Bro. <laughs> no banter. <laughs> Now you know what's funny, see gay people, see gay people, yeah? They know you're not gay. But for some reason, they all just wanted to just like look at me, bro. Yeah, I can't, you should not be annoyed, you should not be paranoid. Bro. I can't no, bro, no, because it was like, I don't know, bro. Like it's so much <laughs> prey or something, bro. Like it's like gay people want to turn straight people gay. So I can relate to what you're saying, you're right, bro. And do I think <laughs> no, but you he didn't say no homo three times before he went in there. I didn't. No, you didn't. I, didn't. I, didn't. I, didn't. I know you had a drink. You had a drink. You had a drink. <laughs> no, I didn't. You had a drink, don't lie. I got, I got my money and kept it moving. You had a head of your coke. But I felt I don't lie. I did feel you like, had a head of your coke. I did feel a bit funny in there, I won't lie. I did feel a bit funny in there, bro. You had a head of your coke, don't lie, man. I did feel a bit funny in there, bro. Don't lie, man. I don't, I don't what, was, game, was it um was it local or was it quay? Local. So you was thinking, right, I hope and no one sees me. The place is closed down now. I hope no one sees Art- me. Remember Artisian World? What? The people don't know what that is. Artisian World? It's basically ones off-road. It's not a gay club, it was a gay night. It makes it even worse, bro. <laughs> man, just call me in a gay The night. one oh. gay time in the venue, man, was there. <laughs> man went to the gay bar, yeah. But yeah, now nah, you're not gay. <laughs> Did you get patted down? The bounce is a normal mandem, bro. Like, the bounce is a mandem. <laughs> the bounce is a mandem. <laughs> questionable. I got I got um, SIA qualified family. I don't think they're working in them particular venues. Well, it's not a gay club. It was a gay night. Yeah, so that means everyone in there is gay, isn't it? You was in a gay atmosphere. One night. He's <laughs> breathing a gay atmosphere there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Missing for one night. Fire. One night only. <laughs> one night only. Was That's... the money worth it? Yeah, and I'll do it again, bro. I'll do it again and again and again and again and again and again. And again, and again. So my customer, bro. <laughs> Do I think he's gay? Nah, I don't think he's gay. Uh, I meant to be questioning sexuality. That's a bit. That's a, that's yeah, how it gets. It feels like crazy. there's something he's not telling. When your brethren said you're gay, that don't make you gay, bro. 
No, but if I feel like they're suffering, he's not telling us, man. So what do you think? If, uh, according to the text, there's nothing out of bounds here. Nah, I don't know, I don't... <sighs> My son has said no homo three times, and how funny that is. That's hilarious. Now you're not, I don't think you're gay, bro. But if you're questioning it, you, you might want to... Yeah, there's some, maybe you liked it a bit too much. Mm. Man, you know when, when, a, when a man score a goal and it's euphoria and everyone's jumping about? Mm. You know what I mean? You're in some... That's not like the club name, bro. Euphoria. <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's, there's a club called Euphoria, though. I think there is. What was you... That, what did you... Did, nah. Was it the first half or the second half? Like, I need, to, I need to know a bit more. How long was you in there for, bro? That can't be the only place you could watch football. You know what I mean? That's yeah, a reach. There's, there's a lot of places that... Do you think he enjoyed himself in, the, in there? Of course. He must have. Did your team win? Did your team yeah, lose? Yeah. Was there a bunch, would you run a bunch of angry gays after? Would you He's got a season, like, season ticket what, to that what club. What was going on? I don't, I don't think it did. Nah, I don't think And this, you know what? I don't know if I want to watch football that badly. Do you know what I mean? What? I, I'm a football man. Bro, if your team are losing 2-0... It's home time. First it's home half. time. There's nothing. Yes, it's over for me, bro. You're not gonna go watch it in the game and watch it. I remember one time Arsenal was playing Chelsea, and I was on the my brother was on the way to my yard to watch the match, and it was like 20 minutes in, it was three 0 and he messaged me like, "Yo, I'm leaving now." I said, it's three 0 but I don't even come. Pause. Like, don't even, don't even reach. Like, just stay at home. <laughs> there's no, there's nothing here for us. The game's over. We're just gonna be sitting down, Rex. There's just yeah, I can't. Nah, man. Could have got a charger. Where? What? I'm, I'm, I'm on it. I'm it on oh, yeah, yeah. I would have more bought a power bank. I've done that. I bought a power bank the other day when I was out with my daughter and she was playing sports and my battery died. I bought a power bank. I, I'm on, I'm, I'm going to be I'm on his side, bro. You have to be. I'm going to go in you there. Have to I'm going to go in there and watch the football match, bro. No, you're not. You don't even like I football, am. You I do. Like I'm an Arsenal supporter now. I'm gonna, the other day, yeah. I was absolutely shocking. But let's not even get into that. I watched the recent episode of the podcast when you guys said you wouldn't ask a woman to com- contribute to the rent if she moved into your house. What about if you moved into moved into hers? Would you take over paying the rent or contribute? What if it was a mortgage? Would you help paying even though you have no stake in the property? property? That was a very good question. I ain't paying no fucking. I ain't paying no one's mortgage if I ain't gonna have shares in it. Burn that. I go get my own. What would I look like? Nah, it's, I think that's the same. The same would apply, bro. If I'm moving to a girl's house, I'm not. I'm not paying a rent, bro. I'm not, I'm You're not, not gonna pay a, a rent. Not paying a rent. I'll it, contribute to the bills in the house. Okay. I'm contributing. I'm not paying. But the rent is what you was paying regardless. The yeah, rent doesn't go up or down if I'm in the house. Pause. It depends on my, on my circumstance as well. Because if, no. if I'm paying rent on my own house, because I, I can't... Being under a woman's thumb, or just anyone's thumb, like where they're in charge of my living arrangement, I don't like that because when it goes wrong... Do you get what I'm saying? So I'm always gonna have my own place and pay my like even like if I'm saying that girl, I'm gonna have my own place just yeah, in case. I've been there many times. She, yeah, do you get what I'm saying? To me, don't ever do that. I learned once. I've got clothes in a black bag once. I said never again. Yeah. So like, mm. how that make you feel? What the, I, I was, the black bag thing? I was the black, I was the black bag bandit, bro. Swear. Pure. I, it's been at least at least fifteen times. At least fifteen times I'm moving my black bags. My car's full up of black bags, bro. But you got a place to go to. When I didn't have a place to go to. When well, you did mums. Yeah, yeah, but you have a place to go to. Yeah, I have a place to go that to. It happened once. And then I said, I'm never... Even if I could... I'm going home. Within... Within a week or two weeks, I'm going to go to my own house. I'm not going to be under the woman's... thumb in her house all the time. But that one time taught me, no, when I had to go, call my bread in, pick me up, Black bag, bag rips, my baggies are all full. I've done that for bare yeah. people as well, bro. My trunks are falling out. No, nah, man, I'm not. It's not happening. It's embarrassing. Imagine you get chuck out late, it's raining. You're walking down the road with black bags, your black bag rips, your trunks are on the floor. Yeah, that's and imagine you're paying. Imagine, imagine you're paying money and then she does that anyway. Then she kicks you up. It's even worse. See, this yeah. wasted a good couple hundreds, thousands, whatever, to get kicked out anyway. Yeah, if if but if I don't have no residence <clears throat> and I'm we're living together, I don't mind paying half the rent. Do you get what I mean? Because yeah, well, I'm if the names on the tenancy or whatever on the mortgage, or whatever it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I'm not paying no if, one's mortgage. But if you're paying no one's mortgage, if, if your girl decides to live with you, are you making her contribute to the rent? Mm-mm. That's what I'm saying. So, but that the person that's asked us now, if you move into a girl's house, are you paying the rent? 
Are you contributing to the rent? Because I'm definitely not. I'm not moving in. I'll stay, but I'm not moving in. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not contributing to the rent, bro. I'm gonna be real. I'm I, not doing it. I've barely moved my um mail. You ever move your mail to someone? No, I still have my mum's. Yeah, I, I don't even. I don't even do that. I don't rent. Maybe if I have no other residence, because then I'm actually living with you. So then I'm like a, a sofa surfer. I'm actually a bum. I'm, I'm, you get what I'm saying? I'm home, I'm what's it? Homosexual. So I'm pause, but I'm, I'm sexing, I'm sexing for a home. Hobo, homosexual. What's that mean, though? Homosexual is what? I, I, is that not what you meant? I'm never gonna call myself a hobo. Because <laughs> you said homosexual. Yeah, home, <laughs> oh, sexual. Oh. Not homosexual. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Oh. They're both that, gay. That, that, They're all gay. <laughs> They're all gay. Homosexual. Yeah. I don't. Ho hobos are why no, to me. What? Like a hobo is What's someone that? who lives. What's a wino? Like an alcoholic guy who lives on the street oh. and begs for change and sells, hobo, of Hobbit. sells big no, issue. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Hobo sexual. Oh, it's nice. See the big issue. Let's talk about it, Kiki. What? <laughs> <laughs> How do you even get it, bro? See the big issue. Is that for people that are homeless, bro? Yeah, I'm sure it is. Big issue. Yeah. Ooh, that is amazing. The big really? issue. I'm sure it's oh, specified for homeless lava, people. Lava, that's lava squared. You have squared. to qualify as homeless to get Lava that. squared, Aya. Big Issue magazine. Let me Google this. And the people that always sell you the Big Issue, they, they just look mad, bro. They look like they, they need the money. Yeah, red bibs. Big Issue is one of the UK's leading social businesses and it exists to offer homeless people or individuals at risk of homelessness the opportunity to earn a legitimate income, thereby helping them to reintegrate into mainstream, mainstream society. It is the world's most... Widely circulated street newspaper. I, I don't know. About How much does a big issue even cost? I don't think nobody knows. Let me check. What do they charge you? They, do they say give you give what you can? It must be, innit? Did that say four pound? Nah. So the big issue costs four pound, but collective sales gives a great boost to those often marginalised by society. That's. The... <sighs> Ain't that kind of taking advantage? Of course it is. You're getting people in a vulnerable position to push your product for. Of course. A, for a, Mayor for, for a mayor, that's major. what push your product? Vul vulnerable position. <laughs> vulnerable people. Or did vulnerable I say position to push your product. Oh that's shit, my bad. Major. Vulnerable that's position. That's at four. That's at four, isn't it? Yeah, shit, sorry. That might be a super. That's a major league. That's super major. <laughs> yeah, Zion. Selassie won't let me into Zion for that. Mate, that's, ma that's major yeah. squared. Yeah, <laughs> squared. Major times major. That's pause squared. Major times major. Yeah, that's pause algebra. <laughs> and now we're gonna get onto the confessions part. Yeah. This is the part where Editor Wes basically just puts in random stuff and doesn't pause. Whoa. Yeah, I was going to say it. I was going to say it. Man said a male name randomly puts in. Fuck. And he, no. we've got no idea what's going on, people. Yeah. yeah. So the reactions are actually real if you didn't know. Because people always ask me, yo, you see it? I don't know what's going on. I, I'm going to read it right now. And sometimes the, what's the word I'm looking for? The punctuation, the grammar is absolutely shocking. But Wes... Edit was that's to type it in there like it's proper. It makes it like I can't read. I don't even type it. He stopped it now. Yeah. Since we've done the hours, because that'll be long. Right. Yeah, fire. Sorry, man. He's he's Sorry. level he's level five now, you know. Yeah, he's yeah, he's yeah. he's on the set. I think he might yeah, be on the same level as us, you know. Because he's caught me a few ones today. I can't lie, he's caught me some straight. Why do I get so comfortable around you guys? Pause. <laughs> Why do I let this happen to myself? Like it's annoying, you know. Because I'll be genuinely disappointed, you know. I'll be watching the tapes like, damn! Like, no. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah. Uh, how can I be driving with a girl and she told me I gave her the ick for not speeding? I kicked her out. <laughs> I kicked her out and made her walk 45 minutes to her crib. BC, I don't know, like, Bristol, something, I don't know, Bristol. Oh, BC, Bristol yeah. City, isn't it? University. I've seen these memes as well, like girls doing mad stuff and getting excited when a man drives fast or whatever. First of all, the girl probably doesn't even drive. Yeah, but he was probably doing 20 and a 20. Yeah, that's, that's... Childish. Yeah, that is childish. 20 and 20 is childish. There's no speed cameras, bro. Just... Now, nah, I'm, not, I'm not encouraging it. I'm not encouraging it. I'm not encouraging speed. Because he must speed. have been driving wild I'm slow. Not, I'm not encouraging it. I'm not encouraging it. Because this is... This is mm -mm. I'm not encouraging it. Do, do the speed limit. Do the speed limit. That girl's a psychopath. Nah, man. The 45 minutes is cold, though. That's cold. And she ain't got no peace because she even put in the book of you. You know what I mean? Like, that's embarrassing. She's cheeky to even say that. Do better. Just that. Cause if a man kicked my daughter out of the car... Yeah, make your daughter, she's not going to tell you. She fucking better. She won't tell you. You think, you think the girl that's been kicked out of cars told her dad? No. Or when you're arguing with a thing or whatever, like, I haven't done it before, but I'm arguing with a girl and she's going to tell her dad. What's that dad going to do? That dad's going to be like 45, 50 years old. What's he going to do, bro? 
to a young 25 year old, 18 to 25 year old, like, am I gonna mash him up? Come on, bro. As soon as my daughter's 16, 17, I'm getting her a driver's license, blood. Seriously, <laughs> like, this can't be happening to my opinion. Caught my girl cheating for a second time. That was my last draw, so I came up with a plan. Me and my girl into using sex toys during sex. So I rubbed chili powder onto a vibrator and went to town on her clit. Three seconds in, she's screaming, hope her clit burns forever. I just feel like you're an idiot. Caught my girl cheating for a second time. That was my last show, so I came up with a plan. Me and my girl into using toys during sex. That's a why, isn't it? Me and my girl. That's, that's, that's why I read it like... Because that means you like toys. Do you get what I'm saying? I rub chilli powder onto a vibrator. Because if you ever use a toy with a girl? I've seen a girl use it on herself. You know, I'm not... Yeah, I'm not going to... What am I toying with a girl for? Do you know what I mean? That like, stuff don't really... I don't... I'm, I'm kind of... What do they to create? Vanilla. I'm kind of just basic, bro. I want to be honest. Yeah, I just like regular sex. Yeah, I don't like really, all these extracurricular really, activities. I'm not really on that extra you know I'm, I'm not trying to get on the honour roll, as Vibrate, they say in America. Vibrating stuff in your underwear and, that and all that stuff, and lube, extra lube that's spicing you and all that stuff. I'm not really on all that, bro. Tingly, you know, I'm not thick rings and that. Just pause, major pauses, man. Not all that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you're sus because he sounds like he's enjoying using the toys. Mm. He's basically a stud. When three, you think about three it. Three seconds in, she's screaming. You might as well pack your willy way and use a strap on. Do you know what I mean? You're a stud, bro. Stud. He's a stud. How cheated. you get an enjoyment, you know what I mean? And how, who's your, your girl cheated twice and you well, still made her your one. girl. She cheated once and you were still with her. And you, she cheated again and then you decided to get her back by putting chilli powder on her sex toy. That's an emotional man. I know you don't have a good relationship with your father, <clears> man. You need a strong male role, male, what's it, strong male role, role model role. in your life. Pause. You do, man, because you are ultra feminine. My girl said the only way we can continue to sleep together is if I become a Jehovah's Witness. Long story short, I'm not going door to door with them. The pussy is too far. Do what you got to do, bruh. I don't know if I respect that, bro. Do what you got to do, bruh. It can't be that great that you're going to... Bro. Bro. Can Jehovah's Witnesses even sex? They're fucking jarring, bro. Let's be honest, bro. I fucking hate them. They have me hiding in my yard like they're you used to coming to bun, man. They knock on my door and go, I'm Muslim, bye. Exactly. You have to, you, you lie to them. Yeah, you yeah. tell a lie to them, bro. There's been times where, yeah, I'm, I'm not, yeah, come back later or whatever, he's not here now or whatever, she's not here now, da, da, da. And then you see them and you're hiding in your yard, bro. Like, they yes. pay the fucking rent, like they TV license people. That's mad, are we... Are but we don't blasph- I said it, I said it. Here. <laughs> that draws a line. Yeah, are we blasphemous? They're only trying to spread the Lord's word. Bro, do it in the church, bro. Do it in your own vicinity. Don't come into my flat or my yard or my residence or where I'm staying and do that. Yeah, it's not um, the older You're invading you my s- private space, Knock bro. on a man's door and all them fuckery there. Yeah, man. That's fuck. mad invasive. People I know can't even just turn up to my yard. And you know what I mean? And they bang off your door and they wait there, bro. They can't be bad. They know you're in. Nah, that's just giving me some fucking old school vibes. That's Bailiff doing. vibes. Yeah, bro. They're worse than this. Jehovah Witnesses start clamping cars. That's what you should do. That's what the government... You should incorporate the two and get rid of bailiffs and get Jehovah's Witnesses It's true, though. The Jehovah's Witnesses are not door first and the bailiff fires after. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, for true. They're, they're, that's why they'll definitely get a yard that way. But yeah, bro, I keep, keep spreading the Lord's message. <laughs> Is he going to heaven for that? In no, not, religious theoretical no, terms? he's not doing Because his intentions not, are not pure. His intentions are not pure. That's what I'm about to say. But he's doing it, though. Yeah, for true. LL Cool J. That doesn't make it all right, bro. But then again, there's people not doing nothing. I guess so. I guess you've got to take out the creator when he gets there. Yeah. Take it up. Take it up. Where are you take it? Yeah. That is a worst. Wow. Wes has, has now graduated to the top level of Paul's police. Yeah. And I can't lie. He's doing a good job, bro. We're gonna, have to, start cons- good job. We're gonna have to start consulting him. <laughs> Go start saying, yeah. is that a pause? Was that a pause? Yeah. Yes, pause. Damn it, let me read this quietly before I get cancelled. That's why. That's why. That's why. That's why I said. Uh... I had a crush on this Indian girl, so I masturbated to belly dancing videos, thinking about her. Get how you live, player. Get how you live, man. Why are you? Why are you associating belly dancing with Indian people? They're not the only people that belly dance. When you go to the shisha spot tonight, it's not Indian people belly dancing, bro. Who is it? 
They're like Lithuanian or something or whatever, like Lebanese or something, bro. Turkish That's crazy. Or something. I have not seen an Indian lady in a cheese spot belly dancing. When you go to them high-end restaurants, it's not Indian people belly dancing. Let me type in Indian belly dancing. This must be valid. Because I, I, I was going to do a joke about this. I Googled it. It said it, it, um, it um, originated from Egypt, apparently. Because I said, I was going to say Romanian belly dancing. Yeah, no, it is, it is widely known, pause. It is widely, Whoa. pause. Yeah, there, no, there's quite a few images. And from these images, I can see why you strummed one out to these videos, bro. Why, is it looking brazy like that? You know what it is, though? I, I, I like um, hefty gal. <laughs> do you know what I mean? And these gal there, their belly don't look... Belly dancers can't be hefty, but you can't have a heli hefty. No, but you see, I mean, you could tell she's had a few... A few naan breads. Do you get what I'm saying? You can tell she's had ghee. You get me? It's not that. You know when a girl's belly looks like a man's and it's abbed up? I, I don't like that. I don't like. I like, like a bit of... Anyway. You, know, you know what I'm saying? I like a bit of jiggle jiggle. Look at the chest on that. That was a pause. It's a pause though. You know what I'm saying? That's delectable, bro. Why is there a man belly dancing there? Fire. Click on it. <laughs> I don't want that in my algorithm. Fuck off. <laughs> I just paid for McDonald's using Nexus card after fucking another guy with the condoms he bought. Let me move that again. I just paid for McDonald's using a Nexus card after fucking another guy with the condoms he bought. Yeah, she's cold. I might know Break her. Break that you know. down to me. Break that down to me. Come, I'm lost. I always so get Bob. lost. Once. She's used her ex's card yeah. to buy McDonald's and buy condoms, innit? And she fucked him with the condoms. This happened to me. One girl I used to mess with, I, can't, I gave her my um, bank card to get food once. Hmm. And then one time when we weren't um, talking no more, after we started talking, after that period, she told me she used my card to pay for parking. Oh. So it was only like £2. But hmm. I was furious. Hmm. I was furious. I was hmm. thinking, right, where the fuck was you parking, you bitch? Don't make me pay for parking at next man's yard. I'll mm. smash up your TV. Don't take the piss out of me like that. Oh, so she and bought, it was she such bought a... bought McDonald's and the condoms with mama's card. Basically. Yeah, that's oh, disrespectful. Yeah. You pay for... And that's why I'm not paying no girl's mortgage. Because <laughs> if you dash me out and you're there strumming your new man out in... In the yard. On my... You know what I'm saying? My fuck little that. half of the rent. Yeah, my little contribution to the rent. Fuck that. Two twos, we broke up. You pay off all your mortgage now. Now you've got a new man. You sell the yard. He's got half the money of what I've put into. Do you know Pause. what I mean? Nah, man. Pause that as well, though. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I apologise. So what are we saying about this girl? She's spawn of Satan? She's a piece of shit, man. <laughs> piece of shit. Piece of fucking watery shit as well. The runs. Bad bet, red meat shit. That's what you are. Red meat oh shit. Oh my goodness. I can't take sex seriously when my girl's pussy queefs. The inner kid comes out and I'm on the verge of tears. I'll just be fucking her. She's moaning and then boom. It sounds like she's dropped a bomb. Need to grow up, bro, man. I'm into that queefing shit because that means that there's no more, like my dick filled up everything. There's no room for nothing, even air in there. I can't remember who said that, but I'm, I, I don't mind a queef. That's a major with no specification. <laughs> yeah, sorry, sir. But the viewers then will know the context, man. You know what I mean? Why are nice guys always the biggest losers? Like, damn, if I was on the door open for me and shit, but you broke and you haven't even passed your test yet, oh my day, it's so embarrassing. How do you feel about that? See what I'm saying about these women? They, they, they create these men. They create men like us, bro. They create men like us. Because I'm sure at one stage, we was nice guys, bro. Now... Um, I've, you know what, sorry to cut you here. Go on. I've never been a... Like, I've been a nice guy externally, yeah. <clears throat> but in my head, pause, I don't think I've ever been a nice guy. I know what you mean, though. I've all, it's whether I let it out, pause, like what I'm thinking, but like these sick thoughts I have in my head, I've always had them. I just suppress them. Sick thoughts? Yeah. What do you mean? Like, you see, like... <laughs> like sounds how sadistic. Can, how can I, if for real, how can I put this, pause, um, how can I put this? Sit at me like you want to kick it over, so. <laughs> No, not like that. Not like that. But like, be careful, like there's be women. Be careful, be you careful. see, like good women, yeah. I love them and they're held in high regard. But then there's women like this. He's gonna do bad. Baby. That deserve men like us. Yeah, I know what you mean. Though. Do you know what I mean? I've always thought that. 
I know what you mean. I've all, and then once I had enough confidence within who I am, I wasn't this nice guy. I'll be nice guy to good women, but for the rest of these hoes, they're me. Do you know back in the day when I used to get an old school jersey yeah, and that the man that used to run a train on the team? Let's be, care- be careful about that, man, because now Bill Cosby, Rick Ross, um, it's a slippery slope, bro. I'm still going, bro. <laughs> I'm sliding down this fucking slope, man. Yeah. God damn, bro. So basically, yeah, back in the day, man used to get jerseys, run trains, whatever. I was always the guy that didn't do it and was wanting to know why they're doing it. Do you know what I mean? Oh, so he's the guy that will pay for the prostitute's time and just sit at the edge of the bed nah, and that's, talk. Nah, that's, that's BA. Talk and hold their hands. That's what BA does. Why, I don't, yeah. why are you doing this? Yeah, bro. I was just like, do you know what? They not used to do what they're doing. I used to be like, nah, I'm not doing it. I want to go watch Shaggy Mozi. Pause. Wow. I, I hear you. I don't I, 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 I'm, I'm with you a bit because I think that you, you, there's something mentally wrong with you. For you to, is this, do you know what I mean? Mm. Like, you know what's mad here? Yeah? Just opens another. Um, Maybe that's why I don't board. like ship clubs. You see, like, um, I don't think men ever really say this because it, it takes away, not a power, but like an opportunity here. Yeah? How do you feel about um, porn stars? Like women who are either like porn stars or prostitutes or women that sleep with a lot of men. Like in your brain, pause and deep down in your heart, how do you feel about them? I think they need help. I, I think there's something wrong with you. Yeah. Men don't really say this. <laughs> I think they need help. Yeah, because what they you're doing benefits us. But I'm t- even the men, even these nice guys. No, but, like, women, no, but women that do it for money. I, Women that do it for money, women that do it for free, yeah? The women that do it for free, they genuinely like that. That's their choice. The women that do it for money, I feel like they don't have a choice. No, nah, there's some, they have a choice. You can go work at McDee's or anywhere. But, like, how do you, mm. like, how do you feel about, a, like, I feel, like, I think all porn stars are tapped. Like, I feel like sex workers are tapped. I feel like women that just want to sleep with bare men and, and not, like, I think you're, like, I think, I, I personally think the majority of men, we won't, we, we won't say it, because saying that creates less of them, which um, stops us from doing what we want to do in life. Yeah. But I, we, we don't think you're okay in your head. So would you, so let's flip that, would you be a male escort? Pause. Um, would I? I've slept with numerous women for free. So but like, remember, when you, that, that's by your choice though, you're choosing to sleep with these women. Yeah, when you're I mean, an escort, I'm, you're on a website or wherever you are, and the people are calling you, it could be an 80 year old woman, and I mean, I'm say, not doing it. Here's your money. You can't do that. That's not how it I goes. I can't do that, bro. No, you can't. Listen, you, you can't. If it, you can't do that for an escort, yes, you, you can't can. take the job, bro. No, you don't. No, you don't, bro. You can, but you get less business than that. You can, bro. Then she can say, I'm going to give you a bad review. I don't give a shit. It's cocky speaks for itself, pause. You know what I mean? So then you're doing it by choice, then, really? Yeah, everything. everything look, you have to breathe to live. Look. You don't have to do nothing in this life, bro. You don't have to do nothing. There might be repercussions, but you don't That's have to do nothing. That's I'm saying. The escorts and sex workers and prostitutes, all these things, they're strippers. They're sick in the head, bro. There's something wrong with them. Which is what my point is. This is I think this is how men view you. There's something wrong with them. So, uh, five bags a month, you're not being a sex worker? But I'd be a... But I've been... No. If you want to talk... No. Blood, I've slept with gal for nothing. Yeah, so it's have I. OnlyFans is sex work. Would you do OnlyFans? Um, five bags a month, consistent. What's consistent? Every month. Every month without failure, you get five bags. There's a girl. If I could choose the girl I do it with. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta think about this. This is serious. <coughs> five <coughs> bags a month to stretch out, stretch out, girl, and I'm in, I'm in charge of the production, Everything. the viewership, how it Everything. goes out. Yeah, my content. It could run. No, I'm not, I'm not run. on that. Fuck that, man. But everyone has to know you do OnlyFans. Oh, oh, you didn't throw that in there. Nah, it's because the girl that uh, said... Was. Them, said them put... Throw that in there. <laughs> mad. What I thought was I throw that ass in the circle. The girl the circle that said, said the pussy, they put it in the fire, on Instagram. So... They're tapped, man. You're tapped, bro. You're tapped. <laughs> Uh, let's move tap, on, but wait, let me, what was the actual? Because we've spiraled. Let I me don't just know, see what man. he said. And this is, yeah, men, I, this is what just shows you. The nice guy always finishes last, man. Not every girl. And you know what? I, I agree with her to a point. Because being some over super nice guy, just, you know, them men who take their jacket off and put it over puddles for gal. You know, them men there. You're an idiot. Like, do you get what I'm saying? You're an idiot. And as a man, pass your fucking test, bro. 
Even if you don't, you don't even have to cut, have a look, pass yeah, your but, driving test. But, uh, cool, but on that same, she doesn't, uh, cool, let's say yeah, he's a man that holds his money back. He doesn't, she doesn't, he doesn't, he doesn't floss, he doesn't wear Chris and Dior, he doesn't wear this, doesn't that. He held the door for her and he's trying to pass his test and she's just on him. You're broke, you're holding the door, you're a joke man, you're a loser. How? How? He ain't passed his test. Maybe he's failed. He's tried and failed. They, they, now you're, there's, he's in the mid bracket. There's <laughs> us, him and them man. Them man here who ain't even attempting, you're an Egypt. Yeah. You can't be out here, bro. Just mm. bussing it. Pause. Like some hooker, bust it, bust it, Mr. TFL just busting it, you hooker. (laughs) (laughs) This may sound weird, but I'd rather get cheated on than them leaving me. If they're cheating, that means they'll they'll still want to be with me for whatever reason. But them leaving me tells me they don't want they don't want me, which hurts hurts me more. That's logical. If that's a female, I like her because she's logical. That's logical. This is, that's these new age bad bitches. City nah, girls. man. It city this is girls a woman who... City girls, isn't it? Yeah. That's what it is, bro. Nah, man. They're hookers. They be cheating themselves. I'd rather they're hookers. Be, I'd rather be with someone that cheats with me. Sounds like a good woman. Instead of... Do you of... know what I mean? That's, how, that's, that's what I need in my life. Like, do you know what I mean? She's being realistic. She knows what's important. Bro. There's girl out here acting like they're going to leave if you cheat and then staying. They're in denial. <clears throat> that's true love. That's a woman I'd marry. Like, do you know what I mean? And I, I hate weddings. Do you know what I mean? I'm never getting married. But this is a, if there was a woman up, this makes sense. I'm I'm on the complete opposite side of this, bro. This is brilliant. why, bro. As a former cheater, why? I just don't think it makes sense, bro. You have some more fucking decorum, bro. Have some more etiquette for yourself, bro. Like. You, you'd rather be with a man that cheats on you. Pause. Let's, let me switch it around. So, man, gal, whatever. Your girl cheats on you. No, that's not the same thing. It's the same. It's not the same thing, bro. It's, it's the, not same. the same. thing, bro. It's not the same thing. Bro, men the and se- women cheating se- is the same. Sex isn't the same for men and women. Bro, it's completely different. Men cheating. Do you know who broke this down to me? Boost. It's the same, bro. Boost we- is just saying that for the internet. No, because he's if, not. if we turn the cameras off and talk to him, he's not living by this. Bro, a man cheating and a woman cheating is the same. No, it's not. Sex isn't even in the same. So, how? The key- the, the chemicals way. that get released in men and women is not that, that statement is invalid just factually Same speaking way. it's not when because you have a vagina I have a dick you say who's worse off Who's 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 worse of cheating, the man or the woman? Both, it's both the same. No, it's not the same, bro. Ah, this we're gonna be all day. <laughs> no, but tell me why it's the same. Even though sex for men and women isn't the same, so it's not the same. Cheating is cheating. That's it. You've broken somebody's trust. You broke someone's loyalty. That's it. Whether it's a male, female, dog, cat. Ah, uh, you know, let's letter. Nip, let's nip this in the bud. Have you ever cheated on someone? Yes. And then they've stayed with you after. Yes. Has someone ever cheated on you and you've stayed with them after? No. You're being a hypocrite now. So there you go. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It's all good for the internet and being PC but, but and wanting the, to get more people on your me, side. Though, but it's still the same. I said that's me. Like it's he didn't still, just make the but point. It's still the same. <laughs> I'm saying it's still the same. Though. So why did you stay with them? I'm not a joke, man. Spurt, <laughs> nigga. I ain't staying over there, nigga. You cheat on me, watch the TV. You fucking high. Are you fucking high? But it's still the same. I've got more respect for myself. Yeah, I respect myself highly. You obviously didn't respect yourself enough, or you didn't feel there was more out there for you. Where I know there's way more out there for me, so I'm not gonna settle with this fucking dead fish in the water. <laughs> Why is she a dead fish and you're not? you cheat on me. You're a dead yeah. fish now, you're and, dead. And so you're a dead fish then when you cheat? Of course. No. For it to be the same, the repercussions have to be the same. Yeah. No, it, no, no, no. <laughs> yes, it does. It's not the, it's then that proves it's not the same, innit? It's not the same. If Mike Tyson punch in your face, yeah. and Andrew Joshua punch in your face, it's still a punch in the face though, the repercussions ain't gonna be the same. Uh, it will. No, it won't, bro. One's gonna give you brain damage. They both will. One might give bro. you a black eye. They both will. Probably say that more support yourself, but it'd be different. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You <laughs> fucked yourself there. Pause. Yeah. They're going to punch you differently. So mm-hmm. the They're both going to punch you. There's still a punch in the face. You, you've been punched, but the repercussions are differently because they're not the same strength. Yeah. So you've proved, you've, 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 you've accidentally disproved your <laughs> own point. Let's move on. 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 Uh.
God, this is. Why do some men think they can steal you from your boyfriend just because they have big have a big penis? I've gotten many DMs of men showing me their news, telling me I'd bet I'd like it more than my boyfriend's. It's gross. Men don't understand that women don't care much about size as they do. She wide all you men for being in DMs and their penises. My penis I've is never, tiny. I've never it's minuscule. Said, I have a I've micro penis, so I have no idea. I've never I'm not one of these men. I've showed my hood on webcam though. Oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, what's the context? <laughs> I had a gal and then um. Like one of my first girlfriends and we were just sex crazy and then i went on holiday and then we was like video calling oh. just got a bit frisky <laughs> <laughs> so you do only for five bags because you don't yeah for free. true he would man he would <laughs> the money just needs to be right for him every female i know they've received a dick pic pause yeah for real you know like every single one every yeah. single one that i know it's crazy isn't it not everyone should be allowed on the internet man that's a fact. I but like then again, some, some, because I always think people doing this year, you don't repeatedly do something that doesn't work. Do you get what I mean? Yes and no. Yes and no. Because I think he's doing, there's, but they think it's going to work at once, they think it's going to work sometime. Whether it's worked or not yet, like what's that film called when Will Smith kept doing that thing? He kept buying that, he kept, oh, what's it called man? Not Enemy Estate man. And he's got this little computer thing or something. He's just walking around and he's broke and he's broke and he keeps pitching the same, same thing, same oh, thing, same um, thing, same thing. Happy, happy. Pursuit of happiness when he sleeps in I'm the saying. toilet with his pit in Yeah, basically that's yeah. kind of the same thing like that. Pursuit of happiness. Man sending a dick pic, pursuit of happiness. <laughs> there's, there's my analysis of it. That's it. One day they're going to strike gold and two day they're going to keep... That's it. expert analysis. Yeah, yeah, yeah for real. Yeah, yeah, that was an amazing <laughs> analogy, isn't it? Yeah, that that's what crazy. it is. So... And we all know Will Smith is a mama man anyway, so yeah. I lied to my boyfriend that I've slept with one person when I never have. I'm actually a virgin. That's not, I don't think that's a bad thing. Is it? I don't think it's a bad thing. She's a liar. That's the bit where it's a bit bad. She's lied and devalued herself for no reason. Which is, makes you think like, what's going on upstairs? Like, <laughs> Yeah, but she wanted, obviously he's probably one of them man that's fucked their gal. Yeah, and I know, but which means you can, um, you're not confident in who you are. And you're not, uh, let, like, let's think about, uh, imagine now, let's talk about our age now. A 35 year old woman comes up to you and says, yeah, um, you know, I've, I've liked you for ages. I've watched all your podcasts and asked the man them and your game and stuff, whatever. I follow you on Twitch. That happens you. minus the gaming, but go on. Cool. <laughs> follow him on Twitch, yeah. Shake his face. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and they do that. And then she says, yeah, but I haven't had sex before, I'm a virgin. You're going to be put off. Straight no, away. I won't. No, I won't. Uh, Fuck yeah, off. I would marry her. I ain't getting no virgin now, bro. That's, 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 that's sacred. That's, that's worth exactly. more than money and gold. Yeah, you're going to think there's something wrong with you. Not necessarily. Right, if she looks okay, though. I'm, you know what? Fuck it. I'm willing to risk what's wrong with her. What? Well, because she ain't had sex before? Yeah. That's She's crazy. pure. Nah. She's the only woman who can legally wear white at her, at her own wedding. That's a fact. So these women got to be wearing off white. <laughs> I am using that. You gotta go wear off white at your wedding. Off white. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my god, what happened to Virgil? Yeah, yeah, nah, bro. She's lied because she wants to be with the man, innit? I I was at a party not too long ago, yeah, and not it was it was within the last ten years, so not too long ago, yeah, and um, I remember all sitting down like in the garden talking like in a circle, and this girl said she was a virgin. And I just threw my phone at her straight away. Like, me need to talk more. Like, do you know what I mean? Later on down the line, she won't, because she lied, but that is priceless. My first girlfriend lied to me about being a virgin. My bedroom broke a virginity. Oh yeah, I remember that. And you lot laughed about it. Yeah, yeah. but we was, we didn't like each other for long. Pause. Because of her? Pause that. Indirectly yeah. because of yeah. her? Yeah. And I see him and be like, fuck it, dickhead. I like, used to go out with my girl, but you didn't get nowhere. These times, he done broke a virginity. Me and my girl have been getting very close and sex been great, but she's been persistent for us to have pure sex. But I'm not sure I'm not into that. But she's consistently telling me to do. But what do you guys think? Is it wrong? I don't want. That's how it was. What's your views on that? That's crazy. I've had sex with my girl on period before. <laughs> yeah, so we got to mm-hmm. tread lightly. But, I, but not, not like when the girl's like, yeah, let's just make sure we have it when I'm on a period. 
That's crazy. <laughs> like, if I know she's on and I want to do it, I'm going to do it, bro. <laughs> I rate it. Yeah, yeah I can't rate really. it. Not, not heavy, not on this heavy. Yeah, I knew I was going to say that. She was only spotting. Be, she was, you know, be, I, be, I knew be, that was coming sooner or later. Pause. It can't be the beginning bit. That's yeah. crazy. You can't go chasing waterfalls. Yeah. Nah, no way. I want to say whatever floats your boat, but that's not whatever floats your boat because he's not against it. And the girl is on him to do it. And that's because the sex is so good. Do you know what I mean? She don't want to go without. Is it is it um, optional? I mean, is it acceptable? Like, because there's a saying, if the river runs red, take the dirt track instead. Is that ever acceptable? What, the r- anal? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I've never heard that before, but I knew what you meant when you said it, which is crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. Nah, just, bro, just wait, it's like seven days, bro. Can't wait a week. Or yeah, four but days. If, if you live with a gal and she's putting it on you, there's only so much nose you can do. Do you know what I mean? Nah, man. You ain't got, you ain't got no willpower then. Yeah. None. He None. does. And if you ain't popped your cherry paws, there's no point in it. If you ain't crossed the line, bro, don't. You don't <laughs> want to be like us. We're sick men. My flatmate doesn't know, but when she puts her temple... Wow. Wow. My flatmate doesn't know, but when she puts her tampons in the bin, I go into the bathroom and take them out and keep them on my bedside counter. The smell arouses me like no other thing in uni. I don't even speak to girls because that's all I need. <laughs> hey, the first tweet is, is rumour sneak. <laughs> that's that is disgusting, you know. You know why that's disgusting? Because my brethren had a job, yeah, working for this company. And it was like, he was always telling me about, so you had a job sick, bruv. You start at like, start at like six. We're done by like nine in the morning. Like, I was like, right, what's the job? You get his own van, they give him a fuel card. He gets paid for the whole day. I was like, now, what is this job? I need to know what this job is now, yeah. I've gone on the job I'm with him. I'm even intrigued about this. But I've gone on the job with him, yeah, blood. And he goes to, um, he's not a cleaner, yeah. But in, um, in women's toilets, yeah, there's a bin and then there's this like other thing that's in schools. It's like, it's shaped like that, yeah. Like a, um, like a, like, so like a PC, but a bit narrower and a, like a bit, I don't want to say the word, mm. but like, like that, yeah. And it's like a bin, but it's for period pads and oh. for like tampons. So he collects those, like, do you get what I'm saying? Mm. So he goes there and like some of them, might have a bag in it or some you just change them around in it so he does so his I, he said yeah come shadow me for a day on this job and see if you want to do it but I, I go with him now i realize on the day what we're doing bro so we go in we're walking into like the um the arndale center because oh. he's going to do the toilets in there just recent about five years ago probably yeah walk into the arndale center and he's walking into the woman's toilets i'm like where are you going he's like, i've got to go in there and collect it and then, like he collected like Six of them from the toilets now, yeah. So we go back to the van. We're on to on the way to our next destination, blood. A man's in the van and it's just just smelling menstrual, smelling like bare wet pennies, like it's menstrual, oh, bro. Like it's, oh. I'm I'm borderline gonna vomit, and we ain't even twenty minutes into the shift, like, and I'm just like, you, you just drive around with this smell, and he's like, yeah, you just get used to it after a while. I no, can't no, get no, used no, to that's this. Mad, that's mad. I can't that's get mad. whatever the period is of sitting in this smell to get used to, like, I got big nostrils. Like, do you know what I'm saying? Whatever the period is, to get you period as well. But, sorry for the pun, but whatever the time duration is, yeah, to get past that, that stinks. And I'm a man that's lived with women for years, bro. And dogs, bro, so. Yeah. I smell all types of different smells. I couldn't get, I couldn't get used to that smell, bro. You can't that's get used to it. Used to. I can't get used to it, bro, nah, like it was. So know. you're a sick man. That might be the worst thing I've seen so far. You're past sick, you're psych, not the worst, we've seen some fuckeries, but you're psychotic. Bro, he takes the, period pads out the bin and puts them on his bedside counter. Yeah, but there's man um, rubbing discharge from knickers on their willy. Oh, this, this is top three. Yeah, for real, yeah. Top three. You're All on right. the podium, my brother. <laughs> pause. That is a pause, isn't it? Yeah. That is, isn't it? Yeah. Fucking hell, podium. That's Hold, crazy, yeah. Podium, podium. high up. Where are you yeah. putting him? First, second or third? Where are you putting him? Yeah. That's crazy. Pause, is that what I'm saying? Yeah. Where are you placing him? Yeah, pause sorry. again. Where are you placing him, you know? Man and man not place and position and vulnerable. Position, is that what I'm saying? What position are you going to be in? Pole position, pause. Fire. Wow. That's a pole position. First to the go- first to the body. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Swiftly. 
girl <coughs> like tells me her sexual escapades. I love I love the use of words. Yeah, I like the word as well. I can escapades. Actually, like, you know what I mean. Girl, I like to tell me a sexual escapade because I'm her best friend. I want to vomit each time I hear it, but I have to firm, firm it and just be a good friend. Don't know how long I can keep this going before I snap. Sick man. Well, your waist, man, first of all, because you're just chilling in the friend zone. Just hearing about it. First of all, you start off with girl, I like. And it half oh, I will miss that. Girl, I like tells me. <laughs> yeah. Like... The girl I like, maybe, but anyway, girl I like tells me, cool. Now he's just sitting in the friend zone. Hey, you know, all of, about came out here about all of her sex stories, and he's probably getting excited over it and waiting for her to get, waiting for him to get that chance. I don't know how long it's gonna take before he snaps. She's just using man as a gauge. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> using man as a gauge, like she's just telling him the stories to find out if she's nasty. <laughs> like just using man, you're a tool. <laughs> yeah, you're a lev- you're a spirit level. You're just an apparatus. <laughs> yeah. no, no. We're so disrespectful as men, we don't even take lesbian activity seriously. That's a fact. We don't even take it seriously. Yeah. Like all you like we generally don't. Yeah, they can't like, they can't really do anything. Like if my girl fucked you or fucked another man, that's cheating. Or that's like wow, like that 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 I feel something. If she fucks a woman, I feel nothing. Yeah. Like it don't it don't so count. I said to my girl, what do you prefer if I it's half a cheat. Girl, it's not even a full what I cheat. To her? I can't remember what I said to her and she's like, oh I prefer Did she say you prefer a man? I said, Well it's not gonna happen, but I think she said you prefer me to go over a man than a woman. She's saying that but she don't mean I that. can't remember what she said. I can't remember nah, she said that. Yo, 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 your street cred is yeah, damn. I can't remember what she said, bro. She's not taking you back. You yeah, she's not taking you back. <laughs> she's not taking you back. And that's women, because women don't think that they just do off emotion. So she's so against being cheated on by a woman, yeah. she's just saying anything now yeah. to not let that happen. Yeah. But the moment you let a man in, you seen that film, um, oh, so you doing the bending? <laughs> yeah, you see that Janet Jackson film? You know what really makes me happy? And like, what makes me smile? You know like when you're driving and you see that's like a... That's major though. What? Don't worry about what makes you smile. So. I want to be the reason you smile. <laughs> It's not a major, it's not a major, sorry, 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 But sorry. like, you see like a woman, a woman driving a van. Yeah, I know what you mean though. Do you know what I mean? It, 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 Why? I don't know, it's just so you know out of the mould. Like, it's like, rah, like, look at you, that strong, get, independent that, woman. That used to get me when it's women's bus drivers. Yeah, do you know what I mean? Any, but now there's a lot. But do you know what I mean? Now it's like, look a, at you. When you're in a garage with a bus driver, you see a woman bus driver, you're like... <laughs> yeah, like, do you know what I mean? Look at you breaking the mould, not being typical, stepping out of like, um, societal boxes. Yeah. And you know what I mean? Like, I re- it more than that. Huh? You would have married her, though. You know what's embarrassing, yeah? She's, she's broken the mold. She's not. No, but you know what it is like, um, you know, love, some women. Um, sit <laughs> there. Man, done the silhouette as well, like, broken sorry, the mold. Sorry, but like, um, <laughs> like, you ever been with a. You know, like some women are just dependent on man to do everything. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you're not like that. Yeah. And that, and that. I like that for some reason, because yeah. it means that before there was a pit, like you know, yeah, some then, women. Then, but then she might not, she might not want to fucking. What's that word that they like to use? Submit. Yeah, that's it. I don't. I'm not make you submit, but the, the how. Yeah, your masculinity is never gonna dominate mine. There can only be. There can't be two masculines in a in a. In, no, no. You know what I mean? So my, the, I've been around women that men would perceive as not submissive. And they've said, and then they've been with me, and I've not made us, but I've seen her be more submissive. She said, your masculinity, like, you just ooze masculinity. So it makes me ooze femininity. Mean, like, do you know what I mean? Like, my woman now as well, obviously her ex-husband, she was like, I had to do everything. Like, when we're going out, I have to remember what part of the car, remember this, remember what to do, pay for this park, pay for this. When I'm out of you, I just don't care. Do you know what I mean? You just do what you think. Exactly. So you bring that out of her. Mm. Not everyone can bring that out of her. Hence why a man don't take the lesbian thing serious. Because once I throw the cocky on you, you're not going to want you, carpet dive no more. Like, do you know what I mean? It's, wow. That's why I meant... So, so, so if, let's say you had a girl and she cheated the woman. She's like, Barbados, one club. I ate some pussy. Taking her back? Yeah, taking her back. I don't know if we can be together. Still going to be in that. Still going to link it in that. <sighs> Cause you're a good time. Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> that, you know what I mean? Don't your, threaten this me. This is a with... woman you invested in, though. This is a woman, bro. It's your proper woman. It's your girl. See with me. See with me, yeah. Girl, I'd have to go through. I generally don't know. Girl and baby. I actually mom, don't know. It's completely different for me, bro. Cause you've only got one. You don't know. But see me, girl and baby, mum. Remember, 
My girl now is my girl before my baby mom. Mm. Same with my first baby mom, but we wanted to have a child, so it was it was always gonna be that. Yeah. The f- last one, there wasn't no plan for us to have kids together, bro. Cause I've got enough. I've already got three. I don't want no more kids. So she was my girl before. If she cheated on me on them times over again, would I take her back? You don't know, innit? There's no saying. Because I want to say no, I wouldn't. But then I want to say yes, I would. But then I generally don't know. Nah, because that's only opening doors for more stuff to happen more with girls. And she's going to blame it on that. Yeah, but you know, a threesome is more closer with her than a woman who's not doing that. True. But I'd rather just have a threesome outside. Because I don't... What's it? A po- po- poly- polygamy? Yeah. Polygamy. I follow them pages yes, on Instagram. Like, I, when it scrolls on my timeline, I go, oh, that must be nice. I'm not on that, though. Two girlfriends and one man. You can't even have a man PT as a training a woman, bro. So you definitely can't do that. What, two women live with me? Oh, that... That's the dream. Oh, you thought I'm... Like, you mean two men and one woman? What am I? Derek, am I an idiot? <laughs> nah, get out. Two women and me is the ultimate dream scenario in... Like, do you know what I mean? That's, that's big paper, you know? It is big paper. Why can't it be big love? Do you know what I mean? Big love ain't paying the bills. Because I feel like I've got enough love for two women. Big love ain't paying the bills. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Big love. Like I can, I think a comedian said this. Like I love my mum, I love my dad. I've got enough love for two women. Do you get what I mean? And they outnumber us. You need the paper, bro. He'll meet meet most of something, but oh, my sad bitch caught me something, something, something. Only time they're happy when they when I'm when I'm shopping. Saturn on them lads, I'll find a link. But right, have you ever been with, with, say not your girl, but a girl here, and say it's like your teen, you're around, and she's just chatting, but she's just chatting about, not feminine stuff, but stuff from a feminine perspective, that this conversation would interest a woman, but because it's just me and you, you're talking to, like, not like how her day's been, you know, it's all relevant, like, you're telling me all your problems, but you're going to go and do the same tomorrow, so it's just a waste of a conversation, like, do you know what I mean? Imagine there's two women in the house. When she wants to talk that shit, just go chat to her. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but then you're getting double the headache now. No, they'll just talk to each When you want to talk no, that feminine shit, talk to each other. she's already pissed off. And then now she's pissed off her. And now they're both going to come to you pissed off now. No, you got You know this is not my conversation. You look and just talk amongst each other. You got to solve it. You got to solve it. I feel like it's problematic. Because they'll have beef with each other. And then you got to go to both sides of the house to sort it out. I couldn't do I couldn't live with two women. He can't have beef, man. You need, no, if I had crazy yeah. paper, I could do it. We all sleep in the same bed. How are we going to have beef? And imagine certain times you come back and they, they both bust on that already. They don't want to fuck. You, you can't Impossible. Fight. Impossible, man. And that's happened that. Women don't want to stop. Every night you've come back... Do you reckon you'd happened. cheat? What? You'd still cheat if you had, if you had to cheat? No, I wouldn't cheat. No I think I'd try my hardest pause to make this... I'd... I'll try harder than I've ever tried in ever any relationship ever to make this. I, I'm so grateful of this. I will try my hardest <laughs> pause to make this work. I'll be a good man. I'll go church. I'll go. I'll be a Jehovah's Witness for a t- polygamous relationship. Until I'll try so hard pause to make this work. Like this is my. And the only thing that spoiled it, yeah, is my brother said, "What if they both cheat on you?" And then that that hurt my soul. Now you have got two women cheating on you instead of one. What if they both cheat on you with a girl? I don't even count. I don't even count. Oh, sick, man. That don't even count. Nah, man. That don't even count. If it's the next man now, you gave away, like, my sacred trinity. Yeah, you're an Egypt, man. He's a, um, do you remember back in the day football, we call it um, a goal hanger? <laughs> you're the reason they invented the offside rule. Oh, you, see <laughs> yeah. the, you see the friend zone thing here? Yeah? Can we talk about this for a second? Have you ever... Never. Wait, wait. Never been. Have you ever knowingly been in a friend zone? Never. I don't have females that are friends. Any women I know I've either slept with or I ain't got round to it. See the friend zone thing? I don't understand men that do it, bro. Unless it's your actual friend. Like, I've got female friends that I don't look at like that. What do you mean you don't look at like that? Because of, like, probably how I've met them or where I've met them. Yeah, so there has to be a reason. There has to be a reason yeah, like, that I can't sleep with you. Not like I, I wouldn't. Like, yeah, I would. But, like, it's my brethren's girl or my brethren's yeah, sister like, yeah, or, like, like but, um, yeah. this is a business thing, so me fucking with you is going to mess up the business or there has to be a reason for me. I've told my female friends before, listen, I would do it, you know. I don't want to, but I would. Because if, if, if you rub me the wrong way, I'm going to get tiff. Pause. I was <laughs> I was with some friend, friend, see what I'm saying? I was, I was with some friend. And the guy, uh, I was with some friend and the guys and me were gassing up Hakimi. 
I don't know who that is. Saying that we're gonna do the same. And then one of the girls said, why are we worrying when we don't have the bread for a gold digger to come for us? That hit me, not going to lie. Hakimi's a footballer. Oh. Do you heard about that? Yeah. yeah. Oh, the one that, that um, gave the money away like the other day. His wife tried to take the money from her. Yeah. But any, uh, art, any uh, artist? Huh? Any uh, artist? I don't want to say the word. What, reprimand? Yeah. Why do you say that? Just, uh, someone said it in the thing, that he's apparently he's, he's got done for that. And now we're just disregarding that because his, his wife's tried to sue him. Oh, yeah, I, I think that's a... But is that is it? Is it confirmed guilty though? It's them ones. Is it? Is. Because so, you know, you remember I saw that post. I was like, I ever posted like, yeah, he's smart. He put in his mum's name and this that and the other. Da, 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 da. But then really, when you look deep into it, pause. There was that like, raw. And you know, I hear you, yeah. But you know what it is, yeah. I don't know if this is is bad on my behalf, yeah. But do you remember Mendy, mm. the footballer Mendy, who got done for not done, but got arrested. For, he recently got acquitted, yeah, and. I don't know if this is part of the reason why, yeah, but um, why am I saying acquitted? I watched too much American. He got not guilty. Mm. And um, there was a bit, there was like a, a little video going around of him with the gal in it that allegedly um, accused him, in it. Mm. But in the video, he weren't ours in her. Okay. There, there, this is fully willing. Like, mm. do you know what I mean? And the rich men get our charges thrown at them a lot. Mm. I'm not saying that no rich men can be rich, mm. but when it's situations like, I, I don't know. Do you know what I mean? I'm not going to paint him as a... Yeah. Because women will be willingly want to give it up to you and then at a later date want financial game and blame it on something else. So death to Arsman and all of that, all the way, if you ride R6 and death to... You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Death to them man there. But I'm not just... It's not a, um, a guilty until proven innocent thing to me. Do you get what I'm saying? I need to know specifics. Yeah, but these, these girls that's looking for these these high end pools, males. That's yeah. You know what? It, it just opens up so pools. It opens up so much. High end. Amazing. Your end. What's your end? And it's high. Do you know? How, and it's high. It's on the podium. It's raised. It's raised. Do you know what I mean? It's raised. That was a major, you know. Fuck. But what was you gonna say? Anyway, these these high end males, pools, or sports persons. Cool man, a giraffe. Yeah. <laughs> that's poor. That's high neck. Yeah, yeah. High neck. That's major. That's a major high neck. But like, you, obviously, you're setting your targets too high. Pause. Because <laughs> the, the girl said, oh, that hit me. I'm like, come for us. Pause. I'm not going to lie. That upset me, whatever. Because they ain't got the bread or they ain't got the peas to even make a footballer even look in their direction or somebody of a higher stature. Pause. To look in the direction. Oh, so you're going at the woman who's going at the men. Yeah, man. So you're saying the men ain't got the money, but you ain't with no, no footballer. She's, obviously, the man's got the money, but she said what, what upset her is that she ain't got the money to even make one of them kind of people look at them. It's man them, no? Yeah, this is man them. Nah, man, it's a girl, bro. No, this is a... Look, I was with some friends and the guys and me were gassing up Hakimi saying that we're going to do the same thing. Then one of the girls said, why are we worrying? When we don't have the bread for a gold digger to come for oh, us. Oh, yeah. That so, hit me, yeah. not going to lie, innit? Okay, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah, you've got to get your peas up, basically. Yeah, but can she say that? Because I her peas up. I think the next question to say is, like, is, is she attractive? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for true, innit? That counts. Yeah. Because you're never going to be in that scenario as well as me. Exactly. So, what are you talking about? But yeah, he can manifest. He's saying one day when he gets to where he wants to get to in life, he's going to follow Hakimi. He doesn't have to do it now. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? She like, you're right. you're he ain't got the bread for a gold digger. That's, that's, so that, hurt, yeah. that, that upset him, basically. Hurt him, pause. Yeah, you've got to be more strong. Have more faith in yourself, man, and more self-pride in that. You might not be where you want to be, bro, but you can get there. Do you know what I mean? Don't let us shoot down your imaginary not get ripped off by wedding dreams. Like, do you know what I mean? By divorce, I mean, don't let us shoot down your... Hopefully wow. one day, praise the Lord... You will get to where you want to, and you'll still not let a woman get the better of you. Do you know what I mean? Don't let that. Don't ever let something that someone else says hurt your soul, bro. Do you know what I mean? If you're proud of who you are, that will never happen. Do you know? That's why I can come on here and tell you everything because I love me deep down. Do you know what I mean? What did? What was fire? Loving me or? Come on here wow. and love me deep down. <laughs> no, I didn't. I, I didn't phrase my sentence like that. 
I never well, said, I never phrased it like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the tax, <laughs> isn't it? Government. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're going to watch that back. Pause. Whoa, watch that back. There's too many, bro. Yeah, it's too ridiculous. Many, man. Man. It's just, can yeah. we can we <laughs> like can we seriously have a day off, bro? We can't have a day off, can we? We can't. No, because once it starts, it don't end. Pause. Pause. You Pause. can't, you can't, like you can't, bro. You can't. You cannot, like, you can't turn that off, pause. Once it starts, can't end. That's, you know a, that's I mean? a major. You can't turn that off, pause. Like there's a, I'm, pause. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be 60 <laughs> and someone's gonna say something. And something's gonna click. Do you know what I mean? Some, I might not say it to the room. Mama, mama have dementia. Mama be like, yo, no, mama. Look at that. Yeah. Steam fish. I, I, I <laughs> yeah. It's impossible, bro. It's impossible. Once, once you awaken it, it you, you can't put it back to sleep. You can't. You can't. No, but you know what, though? That was amazing, though. So. There was a stage where I was doing pause back in the day, then it just stopped. Yeah, no. I don't know why it's just... It might have stopped for back. everybody else, but for me, no. Did and it, all, I'm trying to think, did it stop? Because there was a stage where man could definitely say, come. That's what I'm trying to think, did it stop? <sighs> yeah. There was definitely a stage where man could have said, come. Come on, bro, pause. There was definitely a stage. No, but once, lava. Once it was, once it was inducted into the lava hall of fame, it's never been acceptable. So past that moment, no. And everybody in the comments and on the internet saying it's gone too far. Suck your mum. I'm yeah. never gonna stop because I don't live my life to appease you lot, and I never started saying it because you lot liked it. That's so I'm not gonna stop. Like, do you know what I mean? And I don't but care. Some days I want to break though. I want like that's pause. <laughs> Fuck. Pause. Let's go back to the same thing again at that, that moment, bro. It's happened again. I get off the fact. Are we here? Yeah, we are. I get off the fact that I can take my friends' exes or past situationships. I don't care. It gives me this sort of thrill. It gives me this sort of thrill. IDKs, I don't know. Oh, yeah, sorry. I don't know. It gives me this sort of thrill. That's I, the youth in me. Pause. I pretend. Whoa. Major. Mm. You hear that, was? I heard it. I'm trying to, try to say it lowly as well so the mic wouldn't pick it up. <laughs> Pretend that I'm helping my friends by talking to their boyfriends slash situation shits, then they invite them over and they're so naive they just play along. Oh, is this a female? Yeah, she's yeah. dangerous, bro. She's no, dangerous. she's not. She's an idiot because she feels like she's getting one over on someone. Like, if you're with a girl here yeah, mm-hmm. and then you broke up, what is the ultimate... Oh, to beat a bridge. You know what I mean? You're giving the... Ma- you're... You're scoring on goals. Yeah, but no, but she said... Do you know what I mean? City boys versus hot girls. You're scoring on goals. Yeah, but what's this, though? She says, I could take my friends' exes or past situationships. Cool. But then the next part, she says, I pretend I'm helping my friends by talking to their boyfriends slash situations. Then invite them over and they're so naive. They just play along. That's the bit where I'm saying it's brazy. First, it was their past exes and that. Now it's their boyfriends slash situationships that they're with now. And she's invited them over to their yard. It's mad. She's an... Um, what's the word? Is it a double agent? Yeah, yeah she's a double agent. What, she's playing both sides? No, she's on our side. Do you know what I mean? Well, she, she's so posing, she's she's posing she... as a hot girl, but deep down she's a city boy. She's helping us score goals. She's a mole. Do you know? She's wearing a wire. Yeah. She's wearing a wire, basically. She's, she's all for us. Because this is showing you women stop involving your, your female friends in your relationship. She's doing that for us. And she's fucking the exes as well. She's got us bet. She scored bet on goals for us. In the battle of the sexes, she's helping us. But she's us. also helping you cheat as well. Yeah, what, what, what's that? That's not, what do you mean? I'm helping my friends by talking to them, talking to their boyfriend, such a then invite them over. She's inviting the boyfriends over to the yard, bro. Mm-hmm. Or such situationships that they're with. They're already with this girl. Mm-hmm. She is inviting them over to the yard, but she's doing what she's doing with a man. So I'm saying she's helping them cheat. Oh, the man? Yeah. Yeah, but City Boys are still scoring. Still scoring. That's right. Yeah, man. Hold tight. You keep City up the good work. Up. Pause. What? City Boys are still up. Pause. Oh, fuck. Just please. Yeah, man. Keep, do- keep doing up the loads work, man. Big up yourself. No, this next one is crazy. I am 19 year old. Fuck. And yeah. this is so crazy, yeah, because I personally feel like this is a woman. But let me read it anyway. I am 19 years old and I've slept with 71 people. I lost my virginity at 13 and have never had a relationship last longer than four months. Is this bad? And um, 
she, I think this is a woman. Look at the picture. I know, I know. <laughs> she, she knows this is bad because she hasn't even put her, whether it's like, she's worded it so you don't know what sex she is. Do you get what I mean? Because mm. she knows it's crazy. So she wants to, some people, the mystery of you maybe thinking it's a man because you know. So wait. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, that's six years. Let me just do the count on my hand. So she's had to sleep with... Yeah, let me do oh, it. What did you say, six years? 71 divided by six. Is that right? Yeah. What does that work out to be? It's going to have a decimal point. 71 divided by six equals 11 points. So basically 12. So one a, one a month, <clears throat> basically. Is that right? Yeah. Well, she sleeps every man every month. This is how you know I got F in maths. Basically, you just put it, make it be 12. You sleep with a new man every month? Yeah. That's what it's out to be. And you see why I'm saying there's something wrong with them? How does she know it's 71 as well? It could be a, it could be a man though. If it's a man, or a gangster. A man would not ask that, it's that bad. True. The man would not ask that. True. And you know what, I brought my virginity at 13. All right. And I'm trying to think. Was I 71 in by 19? I'm not, I'm not answering that question. You can. I don't know, though. <laughs> I'm definitely not answering that question. I could have been. I very well could have been. What happened What happened to women like... One a month. Because this for, is the same thing. Like, you six remember, years You remember when you said that... Um, you, you, done, you was doing division to justify women sleeping with more than 20 at one point because mm -hmm. of their age, yeah? What happened to women just chilling and healing? Do you know what I mean? She's still a teenager. She's, she basically went for... Her whole teenagers fucking up someone else. Anyway. I think, I, I don't know, because I won't keep in count, but I think you fuck more people than my grandma. I just use my entire fist and like quarter of my forearm to fuck my girl because I'm small. And I use the other hand to stroke myself. Get it done, playboy. Get it done. Let me catch up. And just save your peas and go get surgery. Do you know what I mean? Because you can't be, you can't do that your whole life. Because that's going to give you, um, you know when you're, um, you know when you're a kid, you know when you're like a kid kid, yeah, and you're in the bath, and you're in the bath too long and you, you start to get, your wrinkles. skin gets wrinkles. If you're going to keep, you're going to get permanent wrinkles, bro. So go get some surgery, man. You can't just be fisting that's, gal your whole life. I wouldn't even want to do that to a thing. And you, you got small hands. What does he fist? Your, your whole, like this, yeah. going up there. Are you that? I've never so, done that in my life. My, I think the most I've done is two fingers, bro. I don't want to do no more than that. <laughs> I don't want to put more than two fingers up there, bro. So man, that's... Nah, I'm not on that. I'm not on that. <laughs> that's scary, isn't it? Two fingers is the most that's going up there, bro. I'm not doing anything more than that, bro. Maybe three, actually. I think I've done three. You put two in the front and one around the back? Nah, I'm not on that. <laughs> two in the pink, one in the sink? Yeah. Not on that. Bowling balls in. Not on that. <laughs> No, I'm not on that. Take a girl for bowling ball. <laughs> yeah. Why did that man send it to you though? Let your girl, I took it for a bowling ball, big man. Yeah, that's big disrespect. Would you rather, yeah, quickly? That's a big quickly, disrespect. Quickly, I heard on the radio. A ting that's given head to bear man but ain't fucked as much, or fucked bear man and ain't given head as much. What do you, you got to make this woman your girl? You choose one, a headers or a ting that's beat bear man. Choose one. You've got to flip a coin at this point, <laughs> innit? <laughs> it's the same. No, it's definitely not the same, bro. I'm going with the thing beat Bear Man. I'm going with the thing suck Bear Man's dick. Pause. But I like to kiss. Do you want to go with the thing? There's an answer then. There's an answer. So what is my answer? The girl that's fucked Bear Man. I don't want that, though. <laughs> <laughs> that's your well, you, like you know the <laughs> no one has no said that she's she, no one has said that she's fucked she ain't kissed the bare man that she's fucked that, that's not in the equation but given head you know that her lips have been around that area so you like to kiss so if you want to suck bare man's dick pause that's what you're doing right, but how, how do you Amazing. view a man here yeah, that will go to a girl's yard eat her and go on yam front and then go on the bus home with blue balls you're an idiot. Big joke, man. Big joke, man. Mm. So get like this guy and sucking all the guy and... Yeah, but another another way of that. But I don't even want to beat it, man. That's got a head of her, man. You want man saying that to your gal? 
I don't even want to beat, man. Let's go ahead. Yeah, but then a girl, that's just... Like, because you know, like, it's statistically proven women that sleep with too much men, they don't end up in happy relationships. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen that. Yeah, seen like, that. do you know what I mean? So it's just... Uh, I'm going with the one to beat. And I, and that's I'm, a rock I, and, and a hard I'm, place. Pause. Like, I'm against I mean? that. Pause. I'm against all that stuff, that beating spare man and all that stuff. I'm against yeah. That. But I'm going with that. I'm going with that, bro. We're at an age now where women lie about their numbers anyway. If they take my truth about your numbers and it's significantly high and I have to choose to go with you or to not give a head bare time, I'm going with this and speak there, man. Just taking on bare souls. Do you know what I mean? It's changed. You, just, you don't even know the energy in her if she's fucking bare, man. Do you know what I mean? You don't even know if she is who she is. One of them persons she fucked might yeah, have been Yeah, but you take, it, you take it more personal. For t- if a thing cheats on you, you said, oh, baby, I just fucked him quickly. Da, da, da. Oh. Dad, what do you mean fucked him quickly? Uh, that don't make no sense. It was quick, baby. It was 30 seconds. That don't make no sense. What does it that was mean? quick. You could. But you, she said that I gave do, him a head. You, you as go well. in once and out. That's more than enough. I said that happened. This is when he once, baby. When I took it out, I, I thought about it and I, I'm an idiot. Yeah, but you but got But since you gave him head as well, you're going to be like, bruv, you gave him head. That's crazy. The act of head is crazy. Whatever the forfeit is, I'm going to have to. There's no forfeit. You've got to choose a woman. Headers or the thing that's fucked by a man. What are you choosing? What are you choosing, Wes? The head thing's mad. The head thing's mad. The beating's mad, the though. The beat is mad, but, it's, bro, it's... it's Which it's one are you going to choose, bro? you got to pick one. Which one are you going to choose? You have to choose. No, but you... In, <laughs> like, in my brain, yeah, pause. You're basically telling me to go into the female mad home and just pick one. That's what you're asking me to do. Like, yeah. like I don't know. You have to choose one. Whatever one looks the best. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. I don't know, bro. Like, I've... They're, they're twins. Identical twins. Exactly yeah, that, that's uh, you're both hookers. Let me just have both of you. No, <laughs> like, you know what I mean. You got no standards anyway. Why are you not making me pick one of you, you hoes? Like, come on, man. I don't, I don't know, man. Do come on, man. Pause for that as well. But I don't. <laughs> I did hear that, but I just, uh, I, just let, I let it go. Pause. Did you do the polyamorous thing with them? That's <laughs> disheartening, man. <laughs> Suppose you breed and then you got a daughter, and then that's the parent. True. Are you on two girls now? Alright, let's move on because you like just <laughs> you both didn't answer as well. No, I said I said I said I said the one to speak. What are you saying? You, you, you got choose. a coin. You got a coin on you. No, no, that's not that's <laughs> no. That's, hey, you want head for headers. <laughs> Anytime. <Sounds. laughs> Alright, we're moving on. Anytime we have sex, my girlfriend makes me bust my nut in a cup for her to drink. Drink it. Love her. Was it full stop after that? There's nothing after it. It's just weird. Love her and all. How do I tell her that I don't like it? Oh, love her and all. How do I tell her I don't like it? But there's no comment. Full stop. Nothing. Yeah, but I love you that make me bust in their mouth. Bust in a cup and then drink it. It's busting in her mouth, isn't it? No, but she's. I feel like she's mocking him, bro. You can't get the same feeling. Oh, in terms of that, you gotta stop and then take it out and put it in a in a cup, bro. Hey, you ever heard that? Um that joke by Dave Chappelle and it's like I don't like when women tell me when to come but I like when they tell me where to come mm. like do you get what I'm saying it's like oh come on the TV it's like, okay like mm, you mm. Uh, mm. I hate that. just be grateful bro you know one time I had sex with a girl in the cinema big up you she probably watched this I love you forever I would never be able to say that I've had sex in the cinema without her because it's never happened since so you just got to take your wins where you can bro it's a raw bro. imagine yeah, it's, not like, it's not like you can't though yeah, no, I, but I have. Some men haven't. Imagine you're out, yeah, blah, I'm busting this cup I made this girl drink it. That's a big statement. That's a big statement. My it's not girlfriend. A... It's his girlfriend. It's not a big statement when it's your girlfriend, bro. But the girl I had sex with in the cinema was my girlfriend at the time. Hmm. Hmm. She's got a chance to be here, man. Get yourself a new girl, man. What, because she made you bust in the cup? No, keep her around. But that's yeah, a, yeah, that's yeah, your forever yeah. woman now, isn't it? Why not, though? Bob, he loves her. It's his forever woman. But don't we love hookers? I don't like them. Remember Probably I told you. Don't just, don't just In it, that's that's another. That's I'm scenario. not gonna see you getting into them thoughts there, bro. That's another thing that will just it's fucking serious. rattle my head. Pause. Major. <laughs> Fuck. Now we're overthinking it because that's yeah. Who? What made you think to make me bust in a cup and then you drink it? That's crazy. 
Yeah, but a girl has slurped man up before, though. Yeah, but if a girl says to me, bust on the cup, baby, let me drink it, I'm not going to do it. It's too specific. I'm getting out, I'm getting out of there. I'm it's gone. I'm gone, I'm gone. What if, what if you ask her, what, what was that about? Oh, I saw it in a film. But yeah, you need to lie to me. If you said you didn't. Why is she automatically <laughs> lying? You see what you I'm lie. saying? You got to lie. <laughs> you got to lie. Well, I, I don't know. Yeah. I've, like, been, I've beat, been lying down and, you know, in the hood, just resting on the leg. And there's some... Aftermath, yeah, come and slurp that up. <laughs> you know what I mean? And I, I don't, I don't mind all that. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know for you, big man. I don't know, man. You're and man up, man. Tell her you don't like it, man. I have a man. We are so good, same values, both driven, best friends, very perfect. Only I keep having doubts, and I can only ignore them for so long. The sex isn't given, size isn't sizing. I'm not, I'm literally gagging for some good D, but I'm not a good, I'm not a cheat. What if? He's the one and I just need Jesus. Because that's settling for less. Women are it, never satisfied. That's what, it, that's what it boils down to. She just said the man is very perfect. Best friends. Driven. Same values. We are so good. Hear all them points. And then you say his dick isn't sizing. I'm gagging for good dick. Pause. No, but that's... But come Fuck. on though, man. Pause. But let's be serious, yeah? Like, how... All right. If you want to... Um, what makes a perfect um, woman or relationship to you, yeah? If you were to break it into percentages, yeah? What percentage is sex for you? 50. Do you know what I mean? Sex is a big part for me. 50. Pause. Do you, do you know what I'm saying? Sex is, like, very important to me. Mm. I could... Like, I got, I got a babes, yeah? She hates me. I'm not even friends at the moment, yeah, mm. bro? I told you, she smashed my PlayStation, bro. Mm. But the sex is so good. You wouldn't divide it off. Like, do you know what I mean? Like that just that like, sex is a big like she's my perfect sex partner. There's no one I've ever had better sex with than her. Bro, that's, that, a big, that's a serious statement. That outweighs so blood. Do you know what I mean? There's Gallum, there's Gallum pressing that is up. They're in the fixy percent tax bracket. Mm. Could buy me. Like she couldn't afford me twice. Mm. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Man, even, I'm sorry, like, <laughs> you don't have to say anything. Man, just tap four times. Like, s- sex is important. Because, like, what is all the things she's, she's written? So let's put all the actual um, categories. Whoa. So we are so good, that don't mean nothing. Same values, both driven, that's same values. Best friends, very... Per- so she's named, all right, we're so good, same values, both driven, best friends... Very perfect. That's five things. Sex is 50%. Because then each of them things hold 10%. But sex is a whole 50. Nah, it's not... Bro, settle, man. What the fuck? Nah, you can settle on some other things, not sex. That's why I get out of here So watch this now. If the sex was 50%, great, yeah? Sex was great. They're not good. They're not friends. They've got the same values. They're not driven. He's not perfect. Obviously, no one's perfect anyway, but perfect to her. So let's, let's rule four things out of that. <laughs> you're ruling all that off for sex. Shut up, man. Shut up. You're an idiot. Because it's up. one or the other. She's not an idiot, man. She's, She's an idiot, idiot, man. Shut no, up. No, because you know what? Shut up. Some sex. I don't. Can you learn to be good at sex? <clears throat> yeah. But you can't. Basically, you can learn to find out what your partner likes or the yeah, partner likes. But like, you know, like, have you ever like met your like person who your sexual chemistry is just match, mm. and it's just you haven't had to learn each other. It's just been A1 since same. day one. And you're thinking, well, something's going to go wrong sometime, but like, it never do, does. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. So I don't think you can teach that. I think that just happens. Mm. Do you get what I mean? So you can't teach that. You can... You can maybe... Can you change someone's values? Yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? Values can maybe change. You you might can become best friends, pause. Like, you know what I mean? You, 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 the other stuff you might can build on. But you can't build on that perfect sexual chemistry. You either have it or you don't. So you're saying she should go or she, does she need Jesus? Which one? I'm saying she needs you Jesus. You don't. Needing Jesus ain't even involved in this. Because you're already, have, already having premarital sex. So Jesus really don't like you, according to the rules in the book. Like, do you know what I mean? So I, I'm not saying she's right or wrong. I'm saying that I can understand where she's coming from, Pause. Do you get what I mean? Because sex is important to me. I've, I've come across some... 
you know, like say you want a woman that's ambitious, a woman that hasn't got a long resume, a woman that's CRB's clear, a woman that's got money, a woman that her family has no um, no ailments or she has no um, mental health issues in her family. I've come across women that tick so many boxes, but the sex don't equate to my mad gal. And I've I've given more time to my to my babes with the sexual energy than the one that ticks all these other boxes. This per, I don't know, maybe she's just young, bro, because I thought, Now I'm childish. No, nah, no, nah, nah, I'm not nah, saying I'm, nah, I'm not saying that because at at a younger age, bro, at your age now, you're definitely, definitely not gonna do all that you said. No way, I'm not having that. Do what for we're doing. for remember this is not your woman, so you don't it's your main skew or whatever, but your woman, bro, your woman. You're gonna go with all these other things. Forget this the sex is mediocre, but everything else ticks boxes. She's good, clean, looks after the household, looks after and they ain't got kids. She has got um, ambition, she's driven, you know, she smells good, looks good. All these other what she's ticking, but the sex is not the greatest. But if you're staying with that woman, bro. No, alright, cool. I'm not saying that's not a possibility, <clears throat> but imagine now, yeah. Don't you feel like you're settling for less sexually? Yeah, but and that's always going to be in the back of your mind. And I think this is a part of why, a part of the reason why men cheat, because they're not fulfilled sexually. So they go and look externally. For, I think that's why a load of people cheat because they're not fulfilled sexually. Yeah. If you was happy with what you you had and it was meeting all your requirements and needs, you wouldn't have need to go look elsewhere. Do you get what I mean? Mm. And I don't like to think I'm a settler. I want the best <laughs> for me. Do you know what I mean? Mm. I, I don't know, man. I think she needs you. Depends how important sex is to you. It's sex is important to you. Clearly me. really important because she said she's just gagging for good D. Anyway, let's move on for that, man. I think you need Jesus, though. I don't. My girlfriend has been acting distant to me. She's texting me and linking me like usual, but she's way less affectionate. Her sex drive is so low. Now, plus she doesn't hug or kiss me as much. I've tried talking to her, but she says she's fine. Should I be worried? I hate feeling needy. The last bit is what messed man up. says. See you in the gym, bro. She's got a new man. I hate feeling needy. That's that's the bit that's that messed me up. Your fem your femininity just came out pause like one hundred percent there. If you left that other bit, if you left that line out, no, but don't you, you understand what he's getting at though? I hate feeling needy, bro. Have you ever felt needy with a woman? I felt like I've wanted to see a woman. Yeah, but. I would you word it to yo bro, my my girl's moving at Imagine you know, I hate feeling needy. You're not gonna say that bro. Like a beg. Do you know? Yeah, but it's cause you said needy it was it was threw me off. Yeah, but have you ever asked a girl to come see you or said to a girl I wanna see you or said to a girl I miss you? Yeah. That can be perceived as needy. Yeah, but I'm not gonna say that it's needy though. No, hey, you're you not gonna mean? describe it as that boy. The fact of the matter is If he said I hate feeling the way I feel, it's, him saying needy is threw me off. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, it's thrown me right off. I don't know I don't know how to help you bro. Yeah, you need to, but you're, yeah, that, that's all. Right, let me take out that last word. Let me take out, let me have a look. Yeah, you should be worried still. But the relationship's over. Fuck being worried. You should be looking elsewhere, bro. You should be looking elsewhere. What's it, what's it, um, actions speak louder than words. Her actions are already showing you she's over with this, bro. You just, yeah, yeah you just got, pack it in. You got a cut, you got a cut, man. Yeah, know. put yourself first, bro, man. I know it, it'll hurt for a while, bro, but just, yeah, get over it, man. Oh, People, again, you know what that was. Ask the man them. Did the send your things to the email. He did. How many emails have today? Two, innit? How many? Emails. Two. Don't Two. tell them how much. They were all emails. Keep sending the emails. <laughs> yeah, don't tell them that. Send your emails in, man, so we can help you with your dilemmas and stuff, man. Big up them people that sent in. Keep doing it. Another episode done in the bag.